Step 6. With the vulture now in place and in the down position, place the lower section of the back door in its proper positioning, centering it so that the bottom of the door touches the lip on the bottom section of the vulture's lower assembly. Mark and drill 3 8 inch hole through both pieces. Insert 5 16 by 3 quarter inch bolt to fasten lower section in place using a washer between the two nylon pieces, leaving the nut loose so the lower section of the door will swivel when the unit is raised and lowered. Step 7. Take polymer backing plate and place it against the mounting base. Center it behind the vulture with the curved section towards the front of the mower. This will allow grass to be deflected across the front of the mower. Take the marker and mark the position of the two 5 16 by 3 quarter inch carriage bolts. Drill out the marked positions with a 3 8 drill bit. Insert the 5 16 by 1 half inch carriage bolts and fasten with the flange nuts. Step 8. If you want vulture arm to pass through the backing plate, a 1.5 inch long by 3 8 inch wide slot will need to be taken out using a hacksaw or die grinder with cut off blade attached on it. Your vulture can now be manually positioned using the hairpin clip and hitch pin. Simply raise or lower the vulture while the blades are off and not spinning. Align the holes in that position and insert hitch pin, place hairpin clip in place, and you're now ready to go.